I can only be me, I don't fit in. That's Steph Curry from the three point for the win. Reflect God, reflect greatness, that's the moment. Not stay real, not stay true. You know, no, 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 no. You know, no, 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 no. and you're watching Elk TV. In news this week, after all challenges presented by Hurricane Harvey, now another hurricane is toying with the Caribbean and southeastern United States. That's right, Jessica. Hurricane Irma started all the way across the Atlantic by the Cape of Africa and is now a Category 5 hurricane. In other news, the great gas shortage of last Thursday is over! There was never a gas shortage, Jessica. Yeah, but when every citizen of Burleson talked off their car and filled it with 30 gallons worth of gas cans within 12 hours, totally unnecessary. The gas cans couldn't even keep up with the demand. Let's just hope there's not a run on pizzas in the cafeteria. Don't leave nothing anyway. Well, it appears the same mouth doesn't want to live forever. At least not with full May. The former One Direction singer debuted a totally bald look on Sunday. 24 and rocked a completely smooth scalp. The style is a far cry from his previous looks, which included highlights, buzz cuts, shoulder length, and even green styles. The VHS Theater Department hosted their own improv show Thursday at 7 p.m. It was a hilarious show and well worth the $5 price of admission. Well, that's all for news this week, VHS. I'm Cole Whitehurst. And I'm Jessica Garcia. And you're watching Elf TV. On Friday, September the 1st, our Elk football team won against Saginaw with a score of 7 to 56. That's it for Elk Sports BHS. Remember to keep it lit. Hi there, and welcome to Couch Potato. I'm your host, Cole Whitehurst, and today we have none other than our favorite Matthew, Reginald Moore. Cole, glad to be here, sir. Nice to meet you, sir. It's a pretty comfy couch. So, Reginald, how has your day been? Uh, it's Jonathan, but should I correct you, or are you alright with Reginald? Oh, my day's been great. Sorry, Cole. Okay. A six-year-old child that asks you if Santa Claus is real, what would you tell him? Uh, or her? Santa's dead. Cole. No one ever told me that. Well, it's a grip of reality that you need to, to embrace in your life. I mean, look at you, Cole. You're ridiculous looking. So, sorry. Sorry. We'll get you a therapist. Uh, so, uh, if you could describe your life in a uh, movie title, what would it be? 300. How so? Well, look how fit I am. Well, that's true. I mean, I've got a little bit of you know, fat everywhere, but underneath this, I'm a fit dude. That's somewhere in there. That's pretty, that's pretty cool. Yeah. yeah. 
Yeah, yeah. Mine would be mine would be Toy Story because everyone always plays with my emotions and then throws me away like I'm a piece of plastic. I feel your pain, Cole. I feel your pain. So how long have you been working here at BHS? Well, Cole, I've been here 13 years. Oh, well, that's very nice, but I'm going to have to stop you there for a word from our sponsor. Hit it. Hi there, my name is Mr. Big Pickleton. You see these vegetables here? Yeah! You should stuff these in your face holes, boy. And eat them. Ooh, we these vegetables taste so good. Eat your vegetables and digest them. All right, thank you, Mr. Big Pickleton. So as, as I was saying, Hey, what you talking about? It's my show. This is my time. Alright, now. Sorry. Uh, I just got a little... Was that the guy that you bought the glue for from, for that mustache? Just keep going, Cole. <laughs> We're all enduring this together. So, does the teacher have the right to give homework to a homeless kid? <laughs> I don't think that's ethical. Not to a homeless kid. That's, that's, that's raw. Here's a good one. <laughs> Why can't you drink drinks but you can't food foods? Now, there's something to ponder right there. Yeah, but I, I don't have all the answers. Why are you expecting me to answer a question like that, though? I'm just the host. I'm not awesome, though. Yo, dog. Cole, you're the only one enjoying that. Oh, I see. Well, uh, that about wraps it up for this episode. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time on Couch Potato. Thank you, thank you for your time. Sir. Anytime. All right. Mip. Ah. Uh. <laughs>